a mix up at the back there between Ben Smith and one of his defenders and Christian Brymora thinks he has the goal. He taps into the net past Ben Smith, but it's been given offside. The ball there by Ryan Smith finds Brymora. Brymora turns well, gets forward. Makes about 20 metres down that right-hand sideline and cuts back in to Jake McGinnis. That's brilliant work by Brian Mora. McGinnis looks up, has a hit off the roof of the net. That's probably the best chance that we've seen in the, in the past 10 or 15 minutes. It was a ball whipped in. Jazz Murray, though, punches clear, but Carroll gets another chance. Don Bazzari with the ball at his feet. Bazzari shoots and scores. Brilliant composure there by Don Bazzari. Kept his head. Took a touch to get himself ready. 39 minutes gone. So we're back underway here at Magic Park. Edgeworth went into the break. Ahead 1-0. Well to Bazzari who blasted into the bottom right-hand corner. And we're back underway with Edgeworth kicking off in the black and red stripes. There's Bauer there, giving away a penalty against Jackson Burston. Cheat turnover by the Jets. It's Burston, bottom left-hand corner, makes the score, Edgeworth 2. Jets nil with a brilliantly driven penalty. In the Edgeworth Jets first grade battles next year. So we'll run back through that. Clayton... He's coaching the... He's coaching the Jets youth first grade side. First grade side, and Deans is doing the this side again. I'm pretty... I, I'm not sure what Craig Deans is doing, but I do know Clayton's doing that. Damien's... Well, of course, he'll be coaching Edgeworth. Um, so some interesting grade. battles next year. That has got feature match written all over it. Ryan Smith goes for the, the long ball. Crawley with the ball back inside, but only cleared as far as Greentree. Dane Greentree... Will support back in. The Jets are peppering the box with crosses, but if that happens, I'm walking out. Regan Lundy, though, as I said, the defense worth rising to the challenge, but put in there. Ben Smith yelling at his troops. Here's Carroll whipping it across the face. Sits up nicely. Oh, what a volley! And what a goal there for Adam Corley. And it's all locked up at two all. Will be on the bench for the first grade side. Jets going across the ground now. Nice control, Regan Lundy. Trying to play it through and Edgeworth with the ball. So a chance in the break, break quickly here. The Eagles, this near side. Stepping, stepping, Burston getting away and the Jets knock it over the sideline. Hamilton Olympics skipper. He got sent off in the 22s grand final last year. It's Bizarre again though. And Don Mazzari goes through or under the wall. I'm not sure which one. I think it took a bounce off a bobble. Half an hour away from kickoff. And the Jets have finished one now. We're all locked up, Blake. What a, what a cracker of a game we've got in the 22s. But now they just need to keep their heads and, and keep a bit of composure and do the little things right. Chris Fay has just got... That will be a send-off. Race Pettit's already been booked once for descent, and then he gets a second yellow for that tackle there on Chris Fayers. He's not happy. There's a few contenders. Don Bazzari's got a double, but at the other end, he's a defender, and he's sort of conceded three. Um, Josh Carroll been, has been pretty good up front for Edgy, has his Chris, as has Chris Fayers. Oh! Gee whiz, that is, that's, oh gee, that is a shocking, that is a shocking landing. Jets player went up, I can't see his number plate, but it was I, Dane Greentree, the left I, back. Full time's been blown and we're going to go into a penalty shootout. Well, well, we'll get the graphics sorted out. We've, we've got our graphic this week for the penalty shootout. Just about to run in. He puts that one in, Regan Lundy, so the Jets... Lead 1-0. Referee blows his whistle. Bizarre runs up. Looking for the top left-hand corner and he puts it over. Put his away. 
He does. A brilliant penalty right into the bottom right-hand corner. That's absolutely quality. Let's see how he responds to the pressure of the penalty shootout. Wow. Right into the top right-hand corner. Murray now with the shot. Fires it over. You. Halfway through a shootout, it's surprising. And Jackson slots it. Well, they're back in at Edgeworth now. And he slots it into the bottom right-hand corner. They, get, they ended up with four on the field. And it goes right into the bottom left-hand corner. So it's three all after four. This is the business end. It's now Cody Carroll. Finishes. It'll be up on Bar TV Sports on YouTube. So Carroll... Bursted now. Cool as a cucumber. Puts it past Jazz Murray into the back of the net. The Merchant Jets, rather. He steps up for the sixth penalty and slots it easily. It's now 5-4. Faye is now. Rockets it into the back of the net. Cooley now. Saved by Ben Smith. Carr now. Steps up, scores. Edgeworth Eagles have won the under-22s grand final. Few of the players run to the goal scorer, but most run to the goalkeeper, Ben Smith. Injuries and a penalty shootout. And now we're going to go to Ben down with Chris Fayes. I'm here with our man of the match for the under-22s, Chris Fayes. And Chris, how good is that winning in a penalty shootout? Hey, it's astounding. Like, I, with the Jets last year, uh, on the bench, not didn't take a penalty. It feels good to score one today. It's been great to have your company throughout the season, and it's been great to broadcast the under-22s. Edgeworth, win Edgeworth winning, I should say, in a penalty shootout.